Hello everybody, it's Renee, Country Gal 2217 from Vape TV and Sweet Pea 32319 from Twitter. I will be reviewing some illusion juices for you today. Starting out about illusion, he is amazing, very stand up guy. He is one of the sweetest guys I've met on Vape TV and I'm thankful that I met him, honestly. He's, he's just amazing. Um, Here's his card. And his site is www.illusion.us. And he, he's just amazing. He um his labels are clear, which I love. It's very chic, very hip. Only clear labels I've seen. Um, I think he does it so you can see the level that your juice is at through the label. Um, he makes all of his concentrates himself. They're all made in the United States. And it's it's just very amazing how he does things. When I ordered my juice, he made it that night and shipped it out the next day. And I got my juice in three business days. I ordered it on a Friday night and I got it yesterday. Yeah, yesterday. And um, just very amazing. It's, what can I say? He's, he's just great. I'm going to be reviewing three of his juices for you today. I'm going to be reviewing WNA Cola, Root Beer Cream, and Banana Cream. Um, on the site, it's listed as five milliliters. But the bottle is more like eight. The his bottles are a little bit big, but he fills them all the way up. He doesn't just do the five milliliters. He fills it all the way up for you. And the pricing on them is amazing. I ordered a five fruit sampler pack. Uh, it came with five like listed as five milliliters, but it's eight. Five eight milliliter bottles of fruity flavors, and I ordered two separate flavors: the WNA Cola and Root Beer Cream. Um, pricing on those is oh come on, let me find it. Pricing on the single bottles was six dollars, and the sampler pack is ten dollars. Shipping was five dollars flat rate. So amazing, and like I said, it it's I I, had, I couldn't expect any better customer service than he has given me. Um. I guess let's get started before this takes too long. I'm going to start out with the WNA Polo. I've been vaping this off and on all day. It is amazing. Simply amazing. Mm, I never get tired of that smell. It smells like sarsaparilla. And it tastes like sarsaparilla. It's not a cola. It's, um, for y'all that don't know what sarsaparilla is, it's a plant that they used to make root beer. So, it's got a, a very, I don't know if tangy is the word, but I'm going to use it. It's got a tangy flavor. And I've noticed that if you drink Coca-Cola after vaping this, it tastes like root beer. So, it's, it, it, you don't mess with sarsaparilla, man. It's, it's great. Oh, my, all my juices are 24 milligram mix because I can't vape like that all day. I have a one-year-old, so it's impossible to vape all day. I just vape from time to time when I feel like I need it. Um, and I'm vaping on a 5-volt triple V mod with a drip shield. Awesome vapor. 
these are 70-30 VGPG mix and like I said this is a very down to earth very authentic sarsaparilla taste um, if you're not used to the sarsaparilla taste it can be a bit strong at first but that's just that that's how it tastes that's it's got a very unique flavor to it and it, it can be a bit overwhelming if you're not prepared for it. Okay. On to the root beer cream. I'm thankful for these childproof locks on the caps, but sometimes they can be difficult for even me. Root beer cream smells like vanilla root beer. Like uh, like if you were to go to Sonic and order a root beer with vanilla flavoring in it. I don't know. Uh, I'll go from sarsaparilla, which makes root beer, to root beer cream. Funny, huh? I just love root beer. Oh. Okay. Juice in the mouth. Awesome vapor production once again. It tastes like the um, A and W root beer candies for me. It it tastes fairly sweet. It is um, you could definitely tell it's root beer. Can't so much taste the cream in it. Um, it doesn't quite have the. I'm gonna use it again. Oh my gosh, the um, tangy flavor that the sarsaparilla has. I guess that's what the cream is for to kind of um, to mellow it out a little bit. Yeah. So that's the root beer cream. I'm gonna drop our mat out of here for a second. With all the root beer and sarsaparilla in it. I don't want it to mess with the flavor of the banana. Overdripped. On to the banana cream. Oh, I forgot to smell it. Mm. 
feels kind of like uh, banana raffi taffy. Yeah. Smells like banana raffi taffy to me. And it tastes. It tastes like a, like a homemade banana pudding with vanilla wafers and whipped cream. Um, it's not as sweet as the banana pudding that you would buy in stores. It tastes like a banana pudding that, like, I don't know how you make homemade banana pudding. I guess bananas and sugar, maybe something else, I don't know, but it tastes like the banana pudding my grandmother makes, which she makes it from scratch, and it's very delicious. As you can see, vapor protection is amazing as well, so Yeah. Well, there you go. I will say this much about the W and A cola and the root beer cream. If you have any issues with acid reflux or anything, like I have, um, it kind of kicks it up a little bit. Where the hell is that coming from? What the hell? Because it can also help you decide. That's where, okay, where was I at? Oh, acid reflux. If you have any kind of acid reflux or anything, the sarsaparilla, and, the sarsaparilla, which is the WNA cola, and the root beer cream will kind of mess with it a little bit. I found myself uh, about noon. I had to take a couple of times. Um, but, I mean, the flavor's worth it. It really is. I can't say enough about Illusion. Um, his juices, the ones that I've tried, have been really good and really, really spot on with their flavor. Um, I guess that is it for now, and I will review the other juices that I have from him later on this week. Love y'all. Take care and keep on vaping. <laughs>